Manon is my name. It's a French name, it's Swiss. And uh, my husband was Greek. Um, we got together in London in the 60s. We were very different in age, in mentality. I was a bit hippie on the side and I didn't marry in, in a white dress because I, I don't think there is anything white on me except my hair. My two children got married. I have children on their own, I have their own home. And I'm still here. After he got sick for four years, I just felt different. I was caring more about people's thoughts. I didn't judge so much. Our relationship was much stronger and deeper than whatever we might have thought for that uh, period of time we had together. We had a dream. The joy to be sharing life with the beauty of nature, but a foot away from civilization. Our dream became reality when we moved in uh, 1978 in an unfinished house with two young children. We built our life as we built our house with the material on site, marble, stone from Capandretti, walnut and oak wood. We even spent three summer holiday to cut stone underwater in the island of Thassos to build our fireplace. When I wake up in the morning, there is um, a light which is very special. Prenny country estate. It is the view overlooking the northern suburb of Athens, a glimpse of the sea from my bedroom window. It's a thank you to be alive. It is the smell of the Greek earth, the silver of the olive trees. It is the voice of freedom, freedom, listening to the birds, the bees, the soft sound of the breeze in the trees. It's all easy, 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 easy. It's easy. Now it is time for me to move on and give the next dreamer the chance to fulfill what he has been dreaming of.